the first pair of Nike shoes that I purchased. Hi everyone, let's unpack this luggage from my recent trip to California. So this luggage is brand new. I got it when I was there and I put everything that I bought from there so let's get started okay so the very first item i got is this luggage and it's already very dirty my husband was right that it's not a good idea to get a light color because um, it could get dirt and because this is um, a nylon and not hard case it's definitely uh, prone to getting really dirty that's not really very big deal with me i actually got this from nordstrom rack I was very excited to check it out because six months ago when we were last time we were there they didn't have one and so we went to check it out okay so first item um, this bag is actually a tote that I already have and this is from DKNY this is great for traveling this was the tote I was carrying when we left um, it's very lightweight i love that it's it expands you can stretch it out like this so this is great and it has a lot of pockets inside so this is not brand new but i thought i would show you okay moving on so i got some stuff from adidas um it was like 75 70 percent off almost everything that they have there and I got stuff for myself and for some of my family in the Philippines so this is actually a tank top for my brother he likes jersey tank top and this is the tag price is $50 but I think I only paid like $10 for this one or 15 the most so most of the items were like 10 to $15 and this is a tracksuit for my daughter and I think it's about the same price, $15. I thought it was super cute. And this one, it's a lightweight jacket, a windbreaker, and it has a hood. This is for my aunt in the Philippines. I'm going to send this to her. Um, the Philippines, it doesn't get cold, so lightweight material um, is good. And it rains a lot, and that's why it's a hoodie. So I like this color. Hopefully she likes it too. And this one is $85. But again, I think everything I got are mostly... Um, 10 15 maybe $20 and by the way the outlet is the Tulare outlet if you are traveling in California from NorCal to SoCal or vice versa um, it's a great place to stop by they have some great food there it's not a very big outlet but they have um, some great brands like Nike the typical ones Calvin Klein, Banana Republic, um, Tommy Hilfiger, and a lot more. So this one, I think this is one of the cheapest one I got. I think this is only $8. And love the color. So this is just a basic t-shirt. Another basic t-shirt. Um, so far, the ones I've shown you are the clothes I am giving away to my family in the Philippines. And this one is for my brother. And the next one, I think, is for me. I'm loving pastel color purple. I thought this was a little weird, and weird is something I always like. Look at the double band. So, I thought it's a little interesting. It's super simple. You know, a super, super simple skirt, but it has double waistband. I thought that was weird, but... Very cute. And again, anything weird is something I like. And so, before I got that, actually, I got this first. 
Um, this is not from the outlet, but it was from Sportsman Warehouse. Um, this is a Columbia top. I think I'm getting ready for spring. I was really looking at the pastel colors. That's what my eyes were drawn all the time. And this was sale. So I got this first when we were at the Sportsman Warehouse. And then I saw this and I thought they will work great together. And here is another one for me. It is an oversized shirt. It's a little uh, kind of turtleneck, but it's not fitted on the neck, so I like that. And nothing special. It's just really super oversized. This is size small, but it's very wide, as you could see. And it's it just have like a little very subtle Adidas logo there, and that's it. I love the color again. Pastel color is my thing, and green is my favorite color. And that's why I got it. And I think this is the last item from Adidas. Or maybe there's one more. And this one, another one for me. I've been loving pink lately. And so whenever I get a chance to get one, I really grab it. Especially if it's the pink that I like, which is the lighter color. Again, pastel color. And I think this one will also look great in that skirt that I got. And let's see. Oh, okay, so this one is for from Carter's and it's for my son. And I think this was only six dollars. So again, this is from the outlet. More stuff from the outlet for, for my son. He likes blue, and that's why I tend to pick blue stuff for him. And let we will check out the good stuff later. Um, this is um, from my recent Dior shopping and I got a lot of underwear for my daughter from the swap meet or we call it the Aramate and some tank top for my son let's see what else I got I'm gonna show everything that's not for me and then we will move on with the ones that are for myself this is just a little hoodie t-shirt for my daughter. She likes purple. And I think that's about it. Let's switch the camera so I could show you the rest of the stuff that are mostly for myself. Okay, let's continue. So most of the things here now are for myself. So let's start with the top I got from Banana Republic. And this is just a simple denim top. Um, I wanted to buy a denim top that is like the similar color of my favorite pants that I've been loving recently and my shorts. And I think it'll be cute with my new um, cowboy boots. And I am very excited to wear them with this um, denim top, denim shorts, denim on denim. I think that'll be cute. I also think um, dark denim will look good on these free birds boots that I already have. And I love, love, love these. I super love the texture. Look at that and the rich color. These are from free birds and I got size seven. They only have whole sizes. For boots, I'm typically size seven, um, except for Sword Weitzman, I'm size 6.5. So this is the first item for myself from Banana Republic and I also got myself a simple white dress. Yes, at first I was hesitant to get it because it's very see-through and then I noticed that it actually has like a slip dress inside so that see-through problem will not be a problem anymore. And again, I would love to wear this with my Toral cowboy boots. I think it will be very, very cute. So those are from Banana Republic. Oh, Banana Republic is one of my favorite stores whenever I go to the outlet. Wherever outlet I go, I always check what they have because they always have great sales, like sales on sales. Most of the time, sale items have additional 50% off like this one. So this is on sale for $44.99 
so I only paid like $22.50 for this dress and the top was $36 so it was just $15 $15 $18 so not a bad deal at all so those are a couple of items from Banana Republic and another item from Nordstrom Rack um, again because I love pastel recently I got I saw this and I thought I love it I thought it was cute it's very similar to that um, Tommy Hilfiger top that I got recently but this is a short sleeve and this is actually from the boys section so I got the biggest size which is 13 to 14 and I tried it it was perfect again this is a great match look at that this is gonna be great and moving on I got my Dior shopping of course and look at this look how much items I got and I paid like I think 175 or maybe 180 definitely less than 200 and these are all the items I got and um, I shipped it to my sister-in-law's house and I got this and this so I got two um, free pouch gift with purchase and the items that I actually got are a new eye palette I'm very excited about this um, I'm excited about the pink and the black I'm kind of wanting to try smoky eye and something light for the spring so I definitely would use the pink tones and the black there you go that's that first item from Dior and then I'm gonna show you guys all the stuff that I bought first okay still sticking with pink I got my pink eyeliner so I used to use the black eyeliner the same one but now they have different color and so I was I am very excited to try this so this is pink there you go if you've been watching my videos you know that um, the eyeliner that I'm using now is from Chanel and I really love it if they have different color I'll probably buy from Chanel but since they don't have one uh, I like um, I was very happy that Dior have different colors available for their liquid eyeliner and uh, this is another one I am very excited to try this is a new product forever glow star filter so this is kind of a foundation with apparently some filter effect some really nice glow so that's what they advertise it and I got shade number two I hope it's not gonna be very white and we will see later when I try it and oh the last item that I got is the cleanser that I already used while I was there and I'll show you right here um, what it looks like and I love it well basically I I did not bring my facial wash I only bring with me my Dior essence lotion and so because the set that I got already has facial wash and two other products which are um, makeup remover uh, I thought that would be enough um, late, later on I realized it's really not enough to shortcut on skincare products so next time I'll definitely have to pack most of them if not all yep but the um, makeup remover has been very helpful especially with eyeliner because you know if you are in a hotel or um, in our case most of the time we were at my in-laws house I wouldn't want to accidentally ruin their towels so it's always best to use um, makeup remover just to be super safe not staining the towels with makeup products 
So yep. And now let's move on with all the free items that I got from my recent Dior purchase. I already showed you this red pouch that I really, really love. I love the color. Oh, I just noticed that it has two zippers. It's similar to the pouch that they have on sale. But of course, this is better because it's free. It's very simple. And this is the ribbon that... Um, it came with the box. The box was the typical um, white which I have to unfortunately discard. Usually I keep the boxes and I use I use them for regifting but because um, I am limited in space I have to just discard it. And then this is the pouch I am very very excited about because I want to turn this into a little handbag. And I ordered some materials that I'm going to use to transform this and so stay tuned for that. Um, I think this is going to be a great small summer bag, especially if you are going to a pool. If it's something you can bring poolside or by the beach. And you will not have to worry because um, first, the material and second, this is a free bag so you will it's not something I have to baby, definitely. And all the other free items I got is the Capture Total Serum. Oh no, this is the, sorry, this is the Capture Total Cell Energy. And you already know how this looks, but I'll show you anyway. For those who are watching my videos for the first time or if in case you are curious how the samples look like and this one is a Sauvage. I pick this because um, I think I will gift it to my nephew. Here we go and then let's see what else I got for free. I got free lipstick. I think this is the classic red. And this is an exact miniature of the full size one. Oh, I wasn't very careful. I chopped it a little bit on the tip. Look. Okay, my bad. But yeah, I think I'm sending this to my mom because she loves lipstick. and more stuff and each order always comes with this these are perfect for regifting they are super cute um i saved them for christmas and this is the hand cream sample this is perfect for when you are traveling and i got two samples Monsieur and another sauvage this is how they look And again, I have another, um, this is a miniature size or the lack sample size of the serum. This is perfect again for traveling and also great gift. And another eye serum right here. This is also a great product. Um, I use it a lot whenever I use it for free and I think this one will last for a good month because you don't need a lot. And lastly, a Misty or Fragrance. My sister loves this so I might send this to her. And this is super cute because this is a an exact like um, miniature version of the full size with the actual bow right there. It's super cute. Look at that. Isn't that cute? So, yep, these are all the free items. If you missed um, this is specific um, promo code, don't worry. I recently just published all the promo codes that are available for March. And also, I've been updating my community page. And also, I'm sharing new promo codes via shorts. And this one, it's still available for minimum purchase 
of $200. The um, promo code is SPRINGLOOK24. So if you want this, if you love it, um, definitely this is the best time to grab it because there are other um, gift with purchase um, that will be added on top of the promo code. Because for a um, minimum of $175 right now, if it's still on when you watch this video, you will receive all these items right here. At least I will show you guys right here. And again, this is going to be perfect for my next project and I'm very excited. Just as a reference, I have iPhone mini 12. Yes, I know. It is a very old phone, but I love it because it's small. I'm very sad that iPhone's not making any mini version anymore. But just um, reference, this will definitely fit um, inside here. And I'm very, very sure all other big phone will fit in here with no problem with a lot more space look at that i mean you saw all the stuff i put in it look at that all these samples still fit in here with more space so there you have it those are my new dior products and i will do another video um, reviewing them or using them okay and um, next item, this actually I realized is my very first Nike shoe purchase. So I have two Nikes. One are the ones that I got from when I moved from the Philippines to the U.S. My husband got me some running shoes because we used to do a lot of nature walk and some nature activities. And then the other Nike shoes I, I have are the ones that my friend gifted to me back in, uh, I think that was in 2018. I remember we went for a Black Friday at the outlet. And these are my third pair, which I actually bought. And I am very, very happy they were back on stock. So first, I ordered them from net -a when I saw them because I think it will look great with my coats. Um, I like to wear coats, but sometimes I feel like it looks very formal whenever I wear my coats. And so I kind of want to tone down my whole style or outfit by wearing sneakers versus boots. And so when I saw this, I thought they were perfect. So these are the Nike Air Max and these are the Shima Shima. Um, I think Shima Shima is a designer. I'm not very, very sure, but for those who know, Please comment below. And I love it. So these are suede. And it's leather right here. And I think this is all leather um, except for the sole, which is rubber. But I already wear these at the zoo. We went to um, Fresno Chaffee Zoo. And they are very, very comfortable. The only con is that, so when I got them from net a -Porte, um, I don't know if I just didn't read the sizing information, but these are actually men's. And so for men's, I am typically size 5.5, but these are 6.5. I followed through to size women's size. And so they are kind of big, but it's not a problem. I, they don't feel big. They don't feel like slipping off whenever I'm wearing them. But I could tell that, you know, there's still a lot of room inside um, when I try them on and but they are very comfortable um, I think the only con I don't know if it's because they are new but um, right here uh, only my left foot though um, I felt a little um, snug I guess or maybe a little stiffness um, it could be also with the way I tie them so but overall I love them love the color love the style and they are comfortable so there you have it my the first pair of nike shoes that i purchased okay so the next items are actually for home i'm very very excited i found this right when we moved um from washington state to edmonton and so i tried to buy buy them from here tried I actually found them here. They were available at Bed Bath & Beyond, I think, but they like they were like way more expensive than the US price. And so I ordered them at Wayfair US 
and ship them to my sister-in-law's house because I really want them and I was scared that they might go out of stock this is what got me the engraving I remember when I was a kid our spoons or silverware has engraving and I thought I love that touch versus you know the simple plain ones and I am very very excited to use them they are gorgeous look at that Because we've been moving a lot, since I moved um, to the U.S., I think we've moved like five. This, this is the sixth time moving here in Edmonton. So I don't really invest on um, high-quality home products or I don't really spend on something that I really like. I just buy something for utility, basically. But now I feel like um, because we will have help when we move out, or when we move back to the US, I thought this is the time for me to buy stuff that I really like and that I know that will last really long. So yeah, some of my most of my plates before were all from the Dollar Tree or it, from Burlington Home Goods, but now I'm really really like um, investing on the style that I like. And definitely the quality and this matches the recent um, dinnerware that I purchased and I'll show you a picture right here and I'm very excited to finally have the matching silverware and the silverware that I have right now are very mismatched they all have different sizes and different designs so this is going to be perfect and I also got this caddy to place them on so yeah, those are all the things that I got from my um, recent trip to California and I am actually very excited for our next trip to the US, wherever it is, hopefully somewhere where I have friends or family so I could buy something online and ship it, sh and ship it to them because um, right now other than shipping it to a P.O. box, which not everybody, not all stores does it, the only way for me to buy stuff from the U.S. is to actually go to the U.S. So, yep, those are the stuff that I got. And if you have any questions about the specific product that I got, sizing of any of the clothes that I got, let me know in the comments below. Let me know your favorite. And if you have any feedback, comment for the next or for the different kind of videos I can share with you guys, let me know. I recently did a poll whether or not you want to see the unpacking and some of you voted yes and so here it is. And yep, that's it and stay tuned for my next video because I will be sharing with you up close those your items that I recently got. And thank you so much for sticking with me and for all my subscribers and new subscribers. Thank you so much. I truly appreciate you guys. And for those who have been enjoying my video so far and find it very helpful, especially with, the, especially with your Dior shopping, please consider subscribing because I am very committed in sharing with you guys the latest Dior deals and other great deals in beauty and fashion. Again, thank you so much and see you in my next video. Bye-bye.